Today we are in Palm Beach Gardens at Baskin Palmer Eye Institute where you will be meeting Dr. Terrence O'Brien and this is where art truly meets science. It's the convergence of the latest technology with the femtosecond laser. Dr. O'Brien, who's at risk for cataracts and when do they begin to show up? The average age is about 72 in the United States for cataract surgery. That's when a cataract has become significant to the point where it's impacting visual acuity and activities of daily living. What are some of the latest trends in the laser technology? Well, the femtosecond laser technology is a fundamental breakthrough with a laser that works at a very high frequency, 10 to the minus 15 seconds. That's one millionth of one billionth of a second. Really hard for us to fathom as humans something working at such a fast rate. These lasers have been proven to be useful as well as both safe and effective for their application in cataract surgery. And they're constantly being incrementally upgraded uh, to even greater precision and accuracy. And how do you prepare the patient for the surgery itself and how long does it take? So patient education is fundamental to develop a thorough understanding of how this technology may provide greater precision, accuracy, and safety, especially when it comes to controlling astigmatism, which may lead to less blur after the cataract surgery procedure, which translates to improved function without the necessity for spectacles or contact lenses. Uh, it's performed under topical anesthesia, so some eye drops are put in that help numb the eye. And then within about 90 seconds, the various steps of the femtosecond laser assisted cataract procedure are taken out with the patient very comfortable and not experiencing excessive pain or discomfort. The procedure itself takes about 90 seconds for preparing the eye and applying the laser energy for the various applications. This includes the corneal incisions, possible corneal relaxing incisions to control astigmatism, opening the cataract with the capsulotomy, and then softening the cataract so that it can be more easily aspirated and finally placing the interocular lens. And what should the patient expect in terms of recovery time from this operation? There is a recovery time. Typically most patients are back doing their routine activities within a week of the cataract surgery. Some people it may take a little bit longer, but the entire healing will be about a month. And after a month we can expect most patients will be at a very high level of function. And how important is aftercare? We use topical eye drop medications typically or intraocular medications to facilitate healing and to prevent infection. And these medications are still a very important part of the aftercare, modifying the routine, protecting oneself from sun exposure, and keeping the eyes moist with lubricating eye drops may all help the recovery facilitate uh, more rapidly. It's truly been a great day discovering the latest technology at Baskin Palmer Eye Institute in Palm Beach Gardens with Dr. Terrence O'Brien. We look forward to bringing you more breakthroughs in the future. I'm Leslie Garrett. To be continued.